Test guests are people you're basically gonna comp a stay for so that you can do some trial runs to get started. Get valuable feedback and hopefully a great review in the process. Have you ever been to like the soft launch of a brand new restaurant? Typically their first day, the staff will invite friends and family to come eat for free so that the restaurant has a chance to do a trial run before the real opening uh, to the general public and it gives them an opportunity to work out the kinks and generates word of mouth. It's hard to be unsatisfied with a free dinner out. I use that same concept when I launch a new property. I tell my test guests to just enjoy the space and give any feedback as to what might have been confusing, um, did they arrive and get in okay, was there something they couldn't find, any suggestions that could improve the space, you know, etc. So over time, I've gotten even more strategic about picking out my test guests. I started off just having friends of friends stay. Now I'll pick about five different people to reach out to and they all will do double duty or sometimes triple duty. First, with my ideal guest avatar in mind, I seek out a photographer that would want to stay in exchange for pictures of my space. I've done the same thing for copywriters to help with my captions and listing descriptions. Um, maybe they have a blog about biking and you're right off the bike path. If they are your ideal guest, chances are they're going to have a great time and want to share it with their audience. I don't make them, I just, I just try to pick people who I think will really enjoy it. And it doesn't matter how many followers they have, it's more about how engaged their followers are. I also take that opportunity to do all the cleaning myself, those first few ones, to make checklists for the future caretaker, as well as like fine tune the space based off their feedback. Um, Airbnb has a few requirements to get super host status, which will give you a boost in the algorithm. Uh, one of them is that you need 10 stays. So the sooner you get to that, the better. I still think you only need a max of five test guests to feel comfortable and get the kinks ironed out but this will make you less anxious when you host your first paying guests and it'll help jumpstart you to super host status.